Hey guys, so this is kind of a Black Friday deals video and things I've shopped so far. I wanted this to go up yesterday, you know, Thanksgiving, so y'all could kind of scroll through and shop in between making yourself a plate, but uh, I got really sick. I tested myself COVID, tested myself for COVID twice in the past three days and it's come back negative, but I'm like, this is wrong because I have never felt this way before. We have a robe on because I'm cold. I actually want to put another robe on, but you know, that would be. And the hair has been up um, <laughs> and now it's down. This is, this is uneven poofs. But I was like, no, I need to put this video up because, you know, these are things I'm shopping. I feel slightly better today. Yesterday was, I don't even know what that was. The entire day I was just on my couch. I was going in and out of consciousness. <laughs> um hot cold feeling body aches which i've never experienced before miserable that is awful sinus headache coughing i woke up and i like peed and i was like oh that was kind of difficult to do that walk and then i went to go make my coffee and i was just like i need to sit down i'm exhausted like just that those two motions was like enough to just make me like i'm gonna fall to the floor you know um, and then I took a mucinex, which I should have known better because I never react well with it. I threw up after having that. After my body tried to like absorb it, I threw up. Um, uh, and then to top it all off, <laughs> at night I got my period. So we are feeling not amazing. Um, I'm sure my brows are crooked. I know my liner is off for sure. Um, again, we are filming with our phones, so I apologize if I look at myself just to make sure I'm in frame. We're also sitting down <laughs> because, because we can't stand up. But I'm going to run through some of the things that I've ordered, um, things that are incoming, and yeah. So the first thing we'll talk about is some makeup. I've ordered from the Victoria Beckham sale as well as the Huda Beauty sale. Oh, so all of the links below, the links are good. The coupon codes, I don't know because they change it. Some, some, on Monday, it was like one code. By Wednesday, they changed the code. And by Black Friday, they've changed to another code. So just know that all the sales are valid. And if my code is inaccurate, then when you go to the site, the new code will inevitably be there. So I apologize. I tried to keep up as much as I could, but they keep changing it. Like some sites, not all, but some of the sites just keep changing the code. So um, Victoria Beckham. So I picked up two of the lid lusters. We have Velvet and Starlight. We have four of the eyeliners. We have Bronze, uh, Olive, Navy Noir, and Fig. The highlight in the shade Pearl. It's her Reflect highlight. I really, really like this. And then two of the glosses. We have Tan Line and Picante. So there's Starlight Velvet. And then the shimmer you see from here to here is... The highlight, the glosses in tan line and picante, they're quite sheer glosses. So if your lips are pigmented, like mine are pretty pigmented, the color looks really similar. Um, and then bronze, olive, navy noir, and fig. This bronze shade I have on, and I think it's so pretty. It gives just the right amount of depth. If I only do my waterline, beautiful. But if I also aim to kind of do a little blendy, blend smoky situation, also beautiful. I don't think it's even been like five minutes and I feel slightly dizzy. <laughs> so not good. Okay, so the next sale we did was the Huda Beauty. I got two of her blushes. If you haven't shopped the Huda Beauty sale, you should, if there's stuff that you want. The sales are amazing on there. Um, I got the blushes. I got Sassy Saffron, which I hadn't picked up before. And then I got Milky Rose, which the swatch you're not going to see like on my hand really, but it's a really light pink and it does show up on my skin. There were two freebies. I believe there was a gloss. The Silk Balm Icy Cooling Lip Plumper. If you've tried this, let me know because I don't really like lip plumpers. I feel like they give me... It almost looks like an allergic reaction, so I don't really like that. I also feel like I'm getting an allergic reaction, like it's one hive right here. I noticed when I was doing my makeup today. Um, and then the other freebie was a lipstick. So I picked Raja, which I'm really happy about because Empress was the shade I kind of had my eye on, but Raja was available and Empress was not. It had like sold out. So I'm really happy because I think Empress would have been lighter than this and I don't know that I would have wanted to go lighter than this. So. The formula on here is 
so good so good like so smooth the color is beautiful <coughs> so beautiful sassy saffron blush milky rose blush and then the raja lipstick okay so i got two of the bomb brows full and fluffy brow gel i got it in rich brown i only got two all of her brow products were incredibly reduced so i felt very good about trying these out I don't know that I love this. I think if you have some brows, it would be nice. For me, it just doesn't do much. I might give it to my sister. I got a whole bunch of brow pens. I love her micro shade brow. I probably got, I don't know, like five in rich brown and then two in black brown so the numbers six and seven i used to have seven and eight eight is quite black and while my hairs are black when i tend to fill it in it looks too dark so that's why we got those what else did we get we got a body blur and glow body brush because i like the shape of it um for what i could see the actual body product this came out with people weren't crazy about it but the brush everyone seemed to love so Ooh, yes. So that's why I grabbed the brush because it looked like a good body brush. Oh, and lastly, I got the Musk 12 Travel Spray. I'm a big musk girl. It's a skin scent, so I'm really happy about this. It's really, really beautiful. Right now, my favorite is still Initio's Musk Therapy. I don't know what it is about that, that I smell it and I'm like transported. It's so, so good. Okay, so the next sale I shopped is the Benoid sale. They're doing 30% off. So I got a six pack of the THCO. Um, you can choose in the notes. You can say, okay, I want all cherry lime, but I just did the normal, which is two of each. And you get pina colada, pina colada, cherry lime, blueberry pie. So you get two each of those. Um, and then they gave me a freebie, which is a mixed combination so all three of those gummies mixed into one container for free and then i also got this one it has thcp thch hhop or hhcp hhcp knockout blend watermelon flavor i'm gonna try this so currently the way i do it i keep i cut them into one sixth no this is new so i can't tell you anything about this but delta eight delta nine Delta 10, which is in a dropper form, that is like a happy one. So if you like that, go for that. But these I cut up into six so I can kind of microdose during the day. I'll take one before work. Um, every so often I might take one at lunch. Usually I don't need it. Um, and at night I take a half to fall asleep. I don't know where I was before these. <laughs> I've never not taken one at night ever since I discovered this. And I get a full night of sleep. I wake up. I'm not groggy. I think for you to determine your sleepy time dose... Um, it might take a few nights. Um, you might realize some some portion is like not enough and or another portion might be too much because you don't want to be groggy in the morning. You want to kind of naturally wake up. So for me, it's like a half a gummy. My sister-in-law, I think, is a third. My mom is like at a third. So it really just depends on what you need, like what your body likes. So... Um, big fan of this. Another style I shopped is the Bandelier. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. So you've probably seen their ads say like on Facebook or Instagram because that's how I was introduced to it. They do crossbody cell phone holders and they do it for all different phones and they're like there's leather versions, there's non-leather versions and they're awesome and there's like all these like little accoutrements you can add to it. I actually bought one and returned it because I think I realized that I wouldn't use like a phone crossbody as often as I thought because your phone case is now that phone case and that's not what I want to carry around with me. Uh, so I ended up picking up one up from Amazon. I'll list it below. I don't think it's real leather, but it's great quality. So when I do want to have like my crossbody phone situation, I have it, but I didn't spend like a lot of money on it. But when I was browsing the site, I saw this harness and I was like, that's awesome and amazing. <laughs> now, this is a preference thing. You might not be into it. Um, so, I don't know if I can put it on. Let me put it over my bathrobe, guys. This will totally sell it to you. So, 
you know, it has a strap here. There's two adjustable in the back. These come off, I attach them to show you, but what I like about this is I can just drop my phone in here. Um, and it's like, it can stay in its case. And there's two pockets, so you can just, I would probably just do one of these probably, like on this side, but I love the ease of it. So if you are like me, I am someone that carries the bare minimum in my purse. Like I don't carry anything. It's like phone, card holder, keys, um, a little bit of makeup, blotting papers. I just don't carry much in my bag. So I'm a small bag girl. This is pricey, but I think I got it for 30% off. But even with that discount, this was a splurge. So what sold me on it is the whole thing is matte black. Even the hardware is matte black. They give you an extra one of these. So if you wanted to add something on, and I, I just love that it's really well made. It's all matte black and I don't have to worry about it matching with stuff. And I can take the pouches off if I just kind of want to like cinch everything in. And if I want to carry stuff, I can add the pouches. I'm curious if they have other things that I can attach to it, probably, because I would want to kind of match the finish. So I kind of regret not doing that because I would have gotten 30% off of like any extra things. But because it was already kind of pricey, oh, I just realized. Okay, so not only do you have these two pouches, there's a zip, a huge, okay. This just became so much, wow. Okay, yeah, I'm a big fan of this and I'm excited to style it. Okay, last but not least, I'm gonna share with you guys my haul from Lazy Royal. I actually have another package incoming today. So when I first received this package, I was like, oh, there was like a placard and it was like oil perfumery, okcha, and lazy royal and then it all clicked because my tiktok is sending me these ads like you would not believe and i'm like oh my gosh jesus but they're in fact the same company or same parent company which makes a lot of sense i believe they're canadian based because for me everything kind of ships from niagara falls um and i have how i feel about like dupes um but we can get into that in a different video i'm someone that believes in inspired things but i don't like counterfeit things if that makes any sense at all to you anyway we can talk about that in a different video because this is like happy video sales yay so what this is it's inspired fragrances so home fragrance so you have candles reed diffusers and car air fresheners so the first one i'll show you is called kirchevel bonfire and it's uh supposed to be like by the fireplace um, as someone that does have that scent in a candle and the perfume, I can tell you that this smells really, 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 really similar, but not exact. I think the original is slightly smokier and this one is slightly more vanilla. So if you're into that, that's a good buy. I think if you, they have a tiered discount right now. So if you can get up to 30% off. The next one I have is called Checkmate and this is the Baccarat Rouge dupe. I already have the Reed Diffuser in my house. I think it smells amazing. It's very light and, but I only smell it in like, I have it in my hallway and I only smell it in my hallway. And then every so often I'll get a whiff of it in my living room. So I think it does disperse, uh, but it just depends like, you know, how sensitive your nose is. I wouldn't want it to be stronger than it already is because I don't like really strong scents around me or in my home. I haven't, I'm so out of breath. <laughs> um, I haven't tested out the car air fresheners yet but i did remove the lid to smell it smells good and then the candle again it smells like a much lighter version of baccarat rouge i don't have like a bottle of this but i do have like a gift set that i bought so i know what it smells supposed to smell like and i like the x-ray version than the original i also think if you're into baccarat rouge get orientica amber rouge it's amazing or the ariana grande cloud intense that's also amazing and smells really similar i also have the candle in serengeti i think this is a dupe of, i believe this is a dupe of bal de freak from byredo it's so lovely if you like that scent you will love this candle very similar. 
So Swan Lake is a Delina dupe, and again, smells quite accurate. I got the reed diffuser and the car freshener. It smells so much lighter and brighter than the actual Delina. So I think you're seeing a theme here. Basically, everything is slightly lighter, which I think I prefer, because like when you are scenting a home or a space, you don't want it to be overwhelming, yeah? Um, I got Meet Me in NYC, which is... Oh, why did I get this one? I think this is Gypsy Water. Yes, this is Gypsy Water. I got the car freshener. I don't know if they ca it came in other products because I would have bought them, I think. Um, and then for free, they gave me Buddha Pear, which is a Jo Malone dupe of something I'm not super familiar. They also have their own scents. So I got Dubai Wharf and it's Shisha inspired and fully like this is a Shisha candle. They also have one in coffee. If you've ordered from them before, let me know. I also order from Oil Perfumery and Okcha and those are incoming. So at some point we'll do like a TikTok inspired video because there's a lot of things I've purchased because of TikTok. Um, yeah. I also, wanted to sh I also wanted to show you guys their packaging because it's very gift worthy. So it says Lazy Royal, that's beautiful. And the candle sits in there and the reed diffusers are in the very similar boxes. And this is the car freshener. So just really pretty packaging. Everything is nestled really safely in there. So we love that because these are glass. So those are the items I've purchased so far that have come in. I did shop the sack sale, which was spend $150 and get a $75 gift card. So I got like Dagny Dover, like one of those toiletry bags for 25% off. Dagny Dover themselves are doing 25% off, but I was like, I don't know what the return policy is. I don't feel like looking it up. At least with Saks, I know that with Shoprunner, I'll get free returns if I don't like that. I got a Good American bodysuit and a third item, and I just can't remember what it is, plus a $75 gift card. I also shopped the Saks off the fifth one, which I think was 25% off like clearance items, and then BOGO 50 for fragrance and beauty. I got a trench, like a leather trench. I don't. I think it's faux leather. Um, I've been really into that lately. If you watch Sammy Jeffcoat on <laughs> TikTok, she has this leather trench that I think they don't make anymore. It's a faux leather trench. It's just the way it drapes is beautiful. So um, I got one from All Saints that kind of has that vibe. And then this one that I picked up, I'll link it below if it's not sold out. Um, I'm just looking for the perfect black trench that doesn't have zippers, doesn't have buttons, like just doesn't have anything except just beautiful draping. So we got that. I'm trying to think what else you ordered. Oh, Steve Madden. There's this boot. It's called the London boot and it has this like sculptural gold heel and it's a black patent boot. I've been waiting for that to go on sale. So they're doing 30% off. So I'm really excited about that. I'll list all these things below in case you're interested. There's just so many sales going on. Um, oh, I have a question for you guys. Um, I'm looking into a Tempur-Pedic type mattress if you are someone that has been purchasing mattresses like that for a while let me know because there's so many now like i sleep sleep number i sense i don't know i could be making things up uh but let me know i'm into a more firm mattress i also think we're looking to replace my dad's mattress too so we might just take advantage of the sales right now and get on that kind of thing do I sound like I'm struggling? Because <laughs> I feel like I'm struggling. Anyway, let me know where you're shopping. Everything will be linked below. I apologize if the codes aren't the codes that were in existence like two, three days ago, but when you get to the site, it'll handle itself. Um, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Hopefully we will put in more effort in how we look. Um, thank you.